people have to realize that as a director, you are responsible for that set. That includes many things. Yes, creatively, a lot, lot of responsibility getting the story right, actors, script. But the other, the other responsibility is safety. When you're when you, you know, on a set, we're, we're uh, you know, we're, you know, we have explosions. You have guns. Um, um, so many, so many shows that dealt with violent, you know, scenes, uh, whether it be knives or, or fights or guns or explosions behind actors. I mean, and, but all of it is, it's very detailed, very thought out, very methodical. But then even before you have a safety meeting, you have the effects person, you have the armorist, you have everybody responsible for anything that has to do with that particular um, potential safety problem. And we go through it. Then, and then, okay, we go through it. Okay, you okay this, you okay that. After that, there's your armorist or your special effects person or, or, your, or, or your explosion person. And they all come together. And, and, th and then, then at the end of it, as the director, I, I, I go, let me look, I go, let me look at that gun. That's cold. Let me look at it. I make sure, I make sure that they're blanks. I make sure there's no potential for anything. If there's an explosion that, that where, where actors are in the same scene, I, I walk it, I go, okay, where's the explosion? How much powder? How much this? Where am I putting my actors? It is methodical, methodical. So where I place my actors and, and place and approve the, where the effect's gonna, the, the practical effect's gonna take place, I know it's safe. And that's a director's job. And yes, I believe on this, on Rustic, I, I'm sorry, and I believe, I believe on, Ru, on Rust, um, obviously the armorist was unqualified. Obviously the AD didn't do his or her due diligence of really looking, you look, you open it up, you see what's in that gun. Three, and I'm really sorry because this director was wounded. I, I, I feel he did not do his job. You do not let anything go on that set that has any potential of hurting your actors, your crew, and that's bullets, explosion, what, whatever, karate, whatever stunts, whatever. You stunt, you protect your stunt people. You know, when they're using knives, you, I go, you make sure that if the worst happens, it's not gonna cut you. You absolutely, you go in there, you do your due diligence as a director, and you make sure that whole damn set is safe. So as far as rust, um, absolutely, there were so many mistakes. To me, and, I, and honestly, and maybe I'm out of balance here, I'm not on the set, I don't see their problems, I don't see, I don't, I don't know half of what's going on, but I do know safety on a set. And I can see that it was a lazy set. You know, no one did the job they're supposed to do. And because of this, a wonderful cinematographer, mother, wife is dead. And a director is, was hurt. No excuse, none, zero. And this industry, hopefully we'll learn from, from this particular situation that there are rules on a set, things have to be followed to never, ever let this happen again. You know, I mean, live ammunition and a gun, a prop gun and, and an 80 says cold gun. No, that's ludicrous. And it, well, it's beyond irresponsible. I don't, you know, Someone, it, someone's gone because of literally not doing their job, being lazy, being inadequate, and not caring about their set. 
Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.